Hello YouTube friends, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to calculate percentage changes using OpenOffice. Now the secret to calculating these changes is this formula over here, which is current value over original investment minus 1. When you plug this into a cell, you'll be able to get the percentage change between two different values. As long as this column over here or the column you're operating with is formatted for percentages. Now, if I want to calculate the percentage change between 77p and 80p, what I do is go to this cell over here, then I go up here and click on sum. Okay, now what I'm going to do is put the current value over the original investment in brackets, okay? So the current value is G6. So that's going to go up here, okay? And I'm going to divide that by F6, okay? And I'm going to make sure that G6 over F6 is in brackets. Then I'm going to go and put in minus 1 next to those brackets, okay? So at the moment I've got equals sum brackets g6 over f6 in brackets minus 1, alright? And if I hit accept, then the percentage change is going to be calculated and that is 3.90%. Now to get the percentage changes for the other values going down these columns, all I have to do is go to this cell and drag down from this corner over here, all right? And the percentage change is calculated for everything else. At the moment, these percentage changes look a bit dull. So what I'm going to do is show you how to add color to these percentage changes. When these changes are greater than zero, we will see green in the background. When they are less than zero and negative, we will see a light red in the background. So to get these colors, select this cell over here. Then go to the top left hand corner where it says format. Click on it. Go down to conditional formatting and click on that as well. Now you will see this conditional formatting box. For condition one, if the value is greater than zero, then the background is going to be light green. For condition 2, if the value is less than 0, then the background is going to be light red. We select these features and then click OK. As you can see, the background of this cell is light green. To color in the other cells, you just drag this cell down like this. As you can see, the negative values have gone light red and the positive values have gone light green. Where there is no change, there is no color. We just see a white background. So this is how to calculate percentage changes and add color to those changes on OpenOffice. If this video has been useful to you and you'd like to watch more videos related to mathematics, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already done so. Also, for mathematics proofs, visit mathematics.proofs on Instagram. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon.